Okay, C. Lindelof videos, AP calculus, related rates. This is the rocket problem. So here's the rocket problem. We're given this problem. It said it's an observer stands 700 feet away from the launch pad to observe a rocket launch. The rocket blasts off and maintains a velocity of 900 feet per second. Assume the scenario can be modeled as a right triangle. How fast is the observer to rocket distance changing when the rocket is 2,400 feet from the ground? Okay, so they gave us some stuff here. Uh, one thing they give us, uh, they help us set up this triangle, I already set it up, and they say, okay, A is the altitude, so here's the altitude here. Z is this distance, so I hope you can see this, because Z is this distance here, right? The distance is the hypotenuse of this triangle. So there's the distance right there. And they also tell us that the rocket is launched straight up, right, given the fact that it's a right triangle, at at a rate of 900 feet per second, right? So it's 900, let me make this straight, feet per second, sorry, 900 feet per second. So they want to know how fast is this distance changing. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to set this thing up as a right triangle and say, okay, I have A squared plus B squared is equal to, in our case, Z squared. And the reason I left this B out is because they gave us this initial distance is 700 feet. That was given to us. So there's my 700. I'm going to act like I know what I'm doing, and I'm going to act like I know that 700 squared is 490,000. So A squared plus 490,000 is equal to Z squared. Now I'm going to do the thing that we always do in related rates after we have our equation. Then we differentiate with respect to T. So I'm going to take DDT of this whole mess. And DDT of A squared is 2A DA DT. And remember, we, they gave us DA DT, so we're going to be able to do something with that in a minute. Plus, the first derivative of a constant is 0. Plus, the derivative of this is 2Z DZ DT. Now, think about this just for a second, because what, they, what we want here is they ask us, they ask us here, how fast is the observer to rocket distance changing? So how far, how fast is this changing? From here to here, from here to here, etc. As the rocket goes up, this distance keeps changing. So we want to know what is dz dt, right, at a is equal to 2400. So if you look at this for a second, we can see first off that here's that dz dt that we're looking for. And also, we have DADT, right? They gave us DADT. DADT was given to us at 900. So we can start to go through and fill in the blank. Well, you know, I'm not going to fill in the blanks just yet. Uh, what I'm going to do first, I guess, is I'm going to isolate this. So I want this thing isolated. So I'm going to divide both sides by 2Z. So we'll get DZ DT is equal to... 2a over 2z da dt, right? da dt. That was just my algebra there, da dt. 2 over 2 is 1. That works out terrific. And then here, it looks kind of creepy. It looks kind of bad, but it's not at all because we know what we want. Remember, we want dz dt when a is 2400. So we want dz dt when a is... 2400, right? I had to stop for a second and think about what I wanted to do here because I'm like, what am I, I going to do for this z value, this z value here? I knew that dA dt was 900 because they gave us that value. I'm like, okay, what am I going to do? Well, we have this constant of 700 this base here, and now we have this applied altitude of 2400. So now we have to actually use Pythagorean theorem and solve for this distance here. I'm not going to take you through all that crap math, but it is what you think, a squared plus b squared equals c squared. And if you did that, you would get this value would be 2500. So this actually does go to 2500. When you do the, re when you do the rest of that math out, you finally do get to an answer of 864 feet per
per second. My gosh, that was a lot of work. That was a really good problem. I hope that this was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please let me know. Um, and if you haven't already subscribed, please do. Thanks.